Hello, my name is Craig Wright uh, from Eastern Extinguishers. I'm here today to explain how to safely use a fire extinguisher. The very first consideration when encountering a fire is to raise the alarm and evacuate. Your first responsibility is to safety of life and well-being. So remember, raise the alarm and evacuate. Once you've done that, the only two possible reasons that you would attempt to use an extinguisher would be number one, that you feel confident and equipped to tackle the fire, or number two, that you need to use the extinguisher to assist your means of escape. If one of those situations applies, I'd now like to explain a simple four-step process to using a fire extinguisher safely. Step one, choose the right extinguisher for the type of fire risk. We have here a P50 foam extinguisher, which is rated to use on class A flammable solids, class B flammable liquids, and live electrical fires, eliminating the choice from that equation. Step two, stand two to three meters away from the fire, maintaining a safe distance. Step three, apply the PASS method. P, pull the pin, A, aim at base, S, squeeze the handle, and S, sweep left to right or back and forth in an arc motion to extinguish the fire. Then, once the fire is extinguished, to wait and observe for possible reignition. If it does reignite, repeat that same process again. We now have a fire here burning, a real fire situation. I'll now apply that process with a P50 foam extinguisher to eliminate the fire. So to repeat, if you do feel confident and equipped to tackle the fire, or if you need to use the extinguisher as a means to assist your escape, follow that four step process. Number one, the right extinguisher for the type. Number two, stand two to three meters away from the fire. Number three, apply the PASS process. P, pull the pin. A, aim at base. S, squeeze the handle an S sweep in an arc motion, left to right, back and forth to eliminate the fire. And finally, wait and observe for reignition. If it does reignite, repeat that process again. Thank you for listening.